Hey guys, welcome back to another Windows 10 Mobile Technical Preview review video. So this is build number 10.5.8.164 running on Nokia Lumia 520. So already I have made a first impression video, so make sure to watch that and to get all the change logs, details and everything. Also I uploaded a uh, bug findings that I was I tested on a couple of phones uh, and just make a summarize. Even though that bug is not completely finalized, I have other few bugs and maybe I will round up a new bug series if the new bug didn't came here in very soon, within this week. Also, and a lot of thanks to some of the users who posted me good comments on my YouTube sections and they all reposted a lot of, uh, you know, uh, reviews and bugs and all they are finding. I just verified all of them and some of them are common and I, that's why I made this bug video. And if you guys have anything, you can do let me know on my YouTube channel or on any one Twitter at the GI support. I will try to cover that so and show you guys others in case other guys don't know about that. So already the device was powered on right now in front of you. So you can watch and see how much time it's taking putting everything all. So from last one week, I'm using this phone as a, one of my businesses putting on that one. So I observed a lot of shoes here, things here, some pros and cons. So we're just going to see and uh, all the basic stuffs I have here in the phone. For example, this uh, whatever social network I'm using, Instagram, beta for Windows 10 and the Twitter, of course, Facebook and WhatsApp and Hike Messenger for local here. Couple of the mails and phone calls and everything. And some of the one note thing because word and excel i'm not even able to use it because it's so small tiny keyboard and screen but one note i use a lot because i used to put down some things on my computer and then i used to share it in here and maps i use i used to microsoft edge are really used because it's uh, not very stable i will say so we'll start and see and a couple of issues that i found uh, before we start you can say so the number one is there there are a lot of fridges and not to me but to many of the users who also they also mentioned with the 520 and there are some workaround for that and uh, that i guess is not good solution maybe hopefully we'll wait for the next build and this is a software issue and it should be fixed out there's no like it can be fixed on it's not device specific even my 640 xl sometimes get reached out so that i will say definitely it's uh, system issues os specific issues not the hardware issues and uh, there are some issues like messaging stuff for example if you i already mentioned long back if you try to verify some ot based things and messaging is not showing uh, message on the notification center i don't know even though it is running in the background so i have charged my device completely in the morning again and regarding the backup i will say since this phone is more than two and a half year old so i am getting a day usage with a general usage i can say uh, this is not perfectly because the battery is very old anyway uh, the windows and mobile has optimized the things a bit so you can see it shows three days 30 now but don't believe on that one it's not going to give you that much let me show you quickly the build number what we have here so this is the build number 10.5.8.164 as you can see right so we will begin and we will see all the general usual say so i'm not showing you guys the power user stuff so uh, because this phone is not made for power users so i will just show you guys the basic stuff that general people use uh, in a couple of opening apps switching to back apps and sometimes occasional play games so i only have here the one game because uh, s4 airborne has got some problem if you install an sd card so every time it wasted a lot of gbs of mine even though that phone is working get very freezy if you install a lot of games on that one so that's why i using the temple and tool to play sometimes so let's begin and i will show you guys uh, like outlook mail <coughs> basic stuff that we do here that you should also do calendar if you're checking so sometimes i device works really fast because for the couple of days i say it's very fast and few days back if you have watched my twitter account i've mentioned this device is very freezy i don't know but this is working as of now very nice you can say so it's not very hyper super sensitive performance but anyway it's nice for the low-end device this is one-handed mode and just a quick information guys uh, windows and mobile i think has been rolled out to uh, AT&T customers who are not involved to insider previews. So we'll see a couple of the social chats here. So I just had a common one, Facebook. So loading as usual <coughs> and depends on your internet connection to how the data will loads on. So WhatsApp, it always show loading is good. Never worried about even 93 XL shows the loading stuff for the WhatsApp. Not sure why that. Now uh, let's see the Twitter in case you are using. So it takes uh, usual time to open. Doing something. And uh, let's see the Instagram. This is new Instagram app for the Windows 10 mobile. In case you want to download, I will put the link down below in the show more notes. You can check that. And it's still beta, but it's better than it's a similar way designed to uh, like for the Android phones. If I show you guys here exactly, if you want to see, I can show you guys interface. 
so it, it has the same design as you can say uh, like the Instagram one uh, you can see all the things have the same here this is for the Nexus 6 Android Marshmallow and this is Windows 10 Mobile so roughly they have the same things now but uh, even though this is beta that means there should be some crashes too so let me get resolved uh, no problem with that and we have opened 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 and let's see how many apps we have still there limitation to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 so still 6 apps and make sure to uh, keep those apps closed otherwise your device can get slow in case you guys have any uh, issues and all things you can put me and your request on a hashtag GI support or you can direct tweet me uh, I will try to address that and give you information as soon as possible as the moment I saw the because a lot of people are getting help so maybe uh, you, you should be contacting me on Twitter in case you have any queries and issues so most apps are using fine but uh, that's why I said it's a magical device sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't work let's see how the edge is working I really use edge because uh, small screen is uh, got some lot of uh, pinch and zoom problem so that's why I'm not preferring to use Microsoft Edge here close uh, all tabs let's see and just one weird bug I will show you guys here uh, in case you guys have some you want to type dollar uh, I don't know how you guys type in so let me tell you guys exactly how you type in so for example uh, if you type something and uh, if you type dollar you can see if you selected the language as English uh, it points to a dollar so the best way to write the dollar is to change back to Hindi dictionary and then you can get this dollar right here so if you guys have your password that contains the dollar so make sure to change that then you will get so edge is okay and not very fast I will say don't try on that one the group has some bugs you can watch the bug videos and let's see weather app so if you guys turn your phone off daily and that's what I used to do uh, I used to turn it off uh, uh, every night when I don't have to use so then in that case the Windows 10 mobile works faster because what I think uh, being it's uh, now is a centralized OS like uh, com combined with uh, similar to desktop and all so you should be turning that off desktop obviously to make that work better similar way you can turn this device too so uh, because closing device will close all the open process and everything so you will get a better time so let's see maps so uh, by general usage I can say you can install that and but if you are switching from if you have two devices and when you have with a higher performance device and when it's a low end like 520 so definitely you will feel this is very slow otherwise if you have just 520 and uh, you are using Windows 10 mobile from long time so you will get used to it no problem one drive let's see So we have opened a lot of apps let's see uh, how to app switching is working on and uh, if you use the task manager let's uh, go to the weather so it takes time to open so no shocking on that go to maps and all the things that we opened the initially twitter and everything they went to the background so let us close first and see because right now I am feeling to see that device is getting slower so if we close all and you can see Twitter icon was missing that I put it on the, the bug video so make sure to watch that I will put the link in the show more notes you can check the my playlist section to understand mobile OS bugs store <coughs> You got two stencils of store, not sure how. Outlook calendar. Outlook mail, I guess that was the last one. Yeah, we don't have any bugs now, fine. So now, uh, we open a lot of apps and we have seen performance issues. And uh, let's see, Microsoft Word. We'll play a uh, Temple and Tune after that and see how much time it takes. So, I'll try to play the same game on the devices too. Because Asphalt, I've played a lot. This is taking time. Lots of time to open. I guess it's freezed up. So you can see, uh, device got freezed up in front of you.
so I'm just going to guys restart that device I don't know I just have to restart so hold on okay guys we're back again and I just have to remove out my case and the battery to get that device booted up so that's why I, I'm showing you guys that a lot of issues are still in this uh, current build I don't know it's from 13 and 14 months from now and this 10 mobile is still same buggy and laggy as it was the day one things were not changed at least this freezing issue should not be there so if you guys on windows 1.8.1 i'm requesting you guys to hold on and uh, don't upgrade uh, till uh, watch for the next videos and see whether any freeze is there or not so we'll try, just try to play a game here and see so the 520 freezes a lot and yes i can say that other devices freezes too but not as much then i need to remove the battery uh, they get uh, Think this is all i guess that's ram issues uh, it's not able to handle a lot of stuff maybe the next time it gets features i will hold on this device for as long as it takes to i think if it is a hung up with the memory something hopefully after some time it gets resumed so we'll try to play this temple in two and see so if you as of now you should hang yourself don't upgrade to windows and mobile on the 520 because this thing will get you panic and you'll get annoyed sure for that So it will take I guess 40 to 50 seconds to turn on increase the volume. I guess it's uh, somewhere yeah suddenly came up. So we'll play and see. We'll notice the features I've been playing it closely. Yeah, it's jump, so it takes time. I need to actually, I was pressing very uh, gently uh, as I, I got experienced on 1020 and all that. I'm using that devices from so long. So this touch has some issues, even though the high sensitivity, I have turned that off. So hopefully, and this. See, three up. So once the <coughs> games start, it runs perfectly. The, the same we saw for the Asphalt 8 in the previous video. So in case you guys want to have demos of Asphalt 8, so you can jump up. You can let me know so anyway uh, this game's once it started so minor games will work no problem like uh, candy crush and all and fruit ninja and other games rail rush too and so these kinds of games work so as you can see guys i've shown you guys how the device get freezed up uh, suddenly and uh, there are still a lot of bugs as i shown you the notification didn't came up and sudden freezes store sometimes got problem in downloading and stuff i will show you guys exactly here uh, I'm just annoyed. Uh, it's not with this device actually. I was uh, trying to same with the 630 also, and uh, didn't take the store. So it's not able to install some of the stuffs. Uh, and uh, here's the 630. So I'll show you here. A lot of dust. So it is turned off. If you go to downloads and updates. Uh, so these things are not getting installed uh, let me try in front of you again so you can see in the download size is 0 0.1 mb of 0 0.1 mb i don't know what kind of ratios they are calculating so at least uh, it's general way to show the exact size and how much is decreasing and going on i will make the 630 video tomorrow and 1020 also i was you can see uh, it shows the error code yeah, i don't know what is the error code let me check that error code i'll put that link in the things on this let's see so it's not getting installed and the same issue is in here itself so you can see the issue is still there it's not getting download so anyway guys thanks for watching guys. and i'll talk to you very soon and stay tuned for a lot of stuff from your windows 10 mobile reviews and i'll give you guys another update because i'm using the when i have for putting the video that's why it's taking time this time took time and uh, thanks for watching i'll talk to you next one have a nice day